Okay, good day my cellmates. I am going to get my Swifty swipe tool into action today. Um, if any of you've watched before, it's my very crudely made Swifty swipe tool. I've just basically cut a piece of plastic out of my plastic file divider and this time I've used the PVA glue to glue it to my uh, old spatula um, and I like using this especially for spiral uh, swipes or starburst swipes or whatever you want to call them. Very handy tool anyway to swipe where you've got a little bit more control and you can build yourself different uh, size, sizes or shaped uh, swipers on the top so very crudely made but it's proved um, it's been wonderful actually it's been very good so today I'm going to use my Swifty swipe but if you uh, follow my channel at all you'll know that um, I can change on a whim when things are not going exactly how I would like them to go then I'll change the whole thing so don't be surprised that's the um, thing is ex expect the unexpected that's where I'll say for this one so I am gonna um, pour in spiral around my canvas with these delicious colors that I have here and I will explain as I go along firstly I do want to thank those people that have subscribed to my channel um, and always leave me really lovely positive uh, comments I very much appreciate those comments so, um, so if you haven't subscribed please subscribe but more than anything please um, come along on this art journey with me and and learn as you go along um, and watch yeah watch my videos that would be nice to have you along so 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 I've got I will explain the colors as I layer them they are all um, Montmartre paints which I get in the uh, two litre containers because I paint a lot so I need to buy that size paint most most of all so uh, if you're in the uh, United States, you can get Montmartre paints too. Uh, if you come along to my Acrylic Art by Jilly Cube Facebook page, there's a link on the bottom. Um, I have got, uh, somebody's given me um, a photo screenshot of the uh, US supplier and I've also got my Australian supplier for all of um, acrylic paint pourers in Australia if you're a beginner I do have beginners video on my YouTube channel so please go visit that rightio let's get going um, I'm going to start with okay I've got this it's called green light or light green I've got this left so we're gonna I'm gonna start doing a puddle in the center and going to go round in a spiral 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 there's no right or wrong way just enjoy the process that's what I, oh, I've got a, a booger or something there Blech. okay something not nice Maybe it's come off my gloves. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> yeah, as I was saying, you know, just enjoy the process. There's no right or wrong way to do this. Uh, it, it'll all come out in the end. And if you're not happy with your results, then the worst thing that can happen is that you just scrape your canvas of the paint off it and start again. So not too bad. It's not... Uh, just don't stress over it, just enjoy your process. 
So she goes now. This is a bit like Mardi Gras colours or the I think I've done one Tutti Fruity Paw, I think. So this is um I'm gonna pour a little bit in the centre. Again, this is a bright yellow, just a real bright, vibrant yellow, which I'm quite drawn with a lot of my work, I seem to put yellows in somewhere along. It's uh, actually lovely swiping in yellow. So as I said, don't worry if um, it's not layering the same as mine or just have a go. Just have a go and more than anything, enjoy. So this is going to the bright orange. Bright orange. I'm just, I'm just keeping in the spiral. Keep doing the, might pour some over the very edges so I haven't got to worry, well, I, I don't worry, but <laughs> it, uh, you know, got some already on the edges it means that you haven't got to sort of uh, stretch your paint too much to find those edges okay so this is looking like um, orange lemons and limes at the minute where, where, where do we go okay I think I need to I'm gonna add a bit of my I love this turquoise this is a Montmartre turquoise as well and it's a really lovely turquoise I love it a bit there I hope you're all having a good week um, I am pouring this on a weekend but I probably because I've poured about three or four or I've created about three or four videos when I'm in my studio um, and they obviously don't all come out on the same day so I'm not sure what day this might reach you guys but whatever day it is whether it's a work day or a weekend enjoy it enjoy it life is too short not to okie dokie I need to put some uh, something dark in there so I'm going with the purple nice deep purple I've actually deepened this purple by adding a bit of um, dark red and a bit of um, dark blue now we've got some yumminess happening here some tutti fruity for sure tutti fruity for sure Okay, I'll let you think about what colour you believe I am going to swipe in. <laughs> Don't think with your mind, think with mine. What would crazy colour Jill swipe with? I'll let you have a think about that. So I'm just going to try and swirl this around the canvas. I don't want to kind of lose that round uh, spirally effect of the colours I mean it will be lost when I use my swipey tool I'm pretty sure but I just want to try and I mean I want the colours to overlap because that creates really great interest in a swipe when the colours uh, meld is that the word is that a word meld meld together mold meld so I'm trying to, I'm just trying to keep the circly thing going. Now this does certainly look like at this present time, a groovy baby, something out of the 60s for sure. Now I'm not gonna worry about those edges cause I'll just pick up some of the paint that's come off and just finger pop the edges, finger pop. And even be done when look at all that lovely color there uh, just finger pop the edges just pick it up finger pop it and obviously you'll be left with quite a bit more extra paint when you swipe that gets swiped off probably not so much so with the swifty swipe it's not such an aggressive swipe 
Just move that up, up there a little bit. Just oh, look at those colours. It is quite amazing that when you see it at this stage, um, it looks so different, you know, from what the end product will be. I've had lots of people say that have never seen this art before, that they watch the video. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Dear. Watched the video and thought, what on earth? That's nothing like the photo that showed us it was going to be. And then when they've even gone back when I've said, no, continue to watch it. It is there. And, um, and of course, it reveals itself in a completely different way because of the technique whether you use a swipe or you tilt it more it's there the beauty is there so the color that i'm going to swipe with is dun, 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 a dark navy dark navy it almost looks black but it isn't very rarely do i use black i would rather um make my own navy up which is, I have got a video on um, custom colours in my video uh, library uh, on YouTube. Um, to make this navy, I add the very dark blue, then I add a blob of black, and then a blob of deep green, and it makes this gorgeous navy colour. So I'm going to... Because I'm using my Swifty Swipe, I do the swipe, I do a cross. It goes like this. So do that to begin with, because I'm using my Swifty Swipe. Here's the exciting part. Here's my Swifty Swipe. I could actually... Okay, I'll go from here. I'm going to go out, straight out to each corner, wipe your tool off, wipe your tool off after you, you've swiped, just take it nice and steady, enjoy the process and relax in it, just enjoy, it's complete therapy this is and I mean, like, I have got a friend that said she just stresses her eyeballs out when she knows she's going to try this form of art. Um, but I, I said, why? Oh, well, oh, well. And I said, well, oh, that's not what it's about. Like, just relax. What's the worst that can happen? He's got to swipe some paint off. Like, you know, that is, that's not bad at all. You've just got to swipe paint off. So there you go. Is your swifty swiping? It's a very um, gentle, less aggressive sort of way to go about it. With you, if you concoct yourself up, make yourself up a swifty swipe tool. Very easy. I've had lots of people that have shown me their other um, ideas that they've had and made up their own swipe tools and that's great that's really good yes it's completely taking on a different persona now for sure for sure okay when you pour the colours separately, like I have, instead of mixing them, you know, like doing a dirty cup pour or whatever, you've always got less chance of your colours going muddy. So it's like far more um, success for separation of colours um, and then not going muddy because you've poured them separately and they're not mixing up in a cup or... So if you ever have trouble with your colours muddying, then just go to a process that's pouring your colours separately, like this. Just... That's all good, good, good. So 
So goodbye, Psychedelica. We're going, taking you away. Isn't it um, absolutely amazing how much that, just that little bit of navy really was only just that, that cross in the center you know how much it can really uh, affect this whole painting this that bit of paint pretty amazing I think so I'll take the whole this is actually probably one of the most relaxing processes because you're doing the swipe more controlled and slowly you're not doing it in one big sheet where some people can get overwhelmed where have you got the little tool and it's you can go over where you feel you need to go over again that's all good okay I'll just check that you're still with me people because my um, yeah cameras keep telling me it's filling you know it's got too much uh, what you call it that the memories for filled I keep emptying it, but it's still telling me that memories fill. But, so I'm not sure what's the go with that. Anyway, I'll finish that side off after. So it looks pretty crappy like that. Doesn't look anything special, but hopefully the magic will begin. I've got a new uh, gas uh, cylinder on my torch, so it will flare up and be pretty fierce at first. So I'll turn it down. And I'll merrily go my little way of, okay, can't do this, yeah, it's a new cylinder and it always flares up pretty scary when you've got a new cylinder. Oh, there's actually some beautiful tiny little cells coming up, like little bubbles. love this yellow purple and orange oh that is so gorgeous oh my god well that is spiral 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 A swifty swipe tool come to the rescue look at that i've got some lovely tiny little cells that are developing, you know, right as before my eyes now. Gorgeous. What I'm going to do is I am going to take the opportunity to get some shots, which I've showed you before. Um, when it's like this, there might be some gorgeous cells that you want to just focus in on that you can get um, some shots from that you can make some... Um, prints out of as well as the whole thing so it's is basically I mean I'm just using my iPhone so I just um, come down on the cells that I like some more oh, oh these are gorgeous oh my see look at those gorgeous look so any cells that you like then you can uh, use uh, oh, mirror lab uh, Vaughn photo apps to put them into a frame you can send them off to Vistaprint or Photobox which you just uh, just download them and you can have prints made of them so and I've just had a calendar come that they've made for me out of some of my um, close-ups uh, or did a calendar so I was thinking that I will offer the calendar to my um, YouTube and Facebook um, subscribers so we'll see how that goes that's kind of in, in the uh, plan at the moment but yeah look at that absolutely stunning sorry I had you zoomed in then but thank you again for watching thank you for subscribing to my channel 
and um, I am most appreciative from the fantastic comments I got. Hope you like the spiral um, carnival coloured swifty swipe creation. Okay. It's nice and vibrant and it's uplifting. So I'll see you again next time. Please join me on my acrylic art for Jilly Cube or subscribe or please make sure you watch my next video. And I truly, truly appreciate you guys so much. I will put some photos on at the end of this um, video um, of the dried results. And if I do come back and do anything different, I will, um, post those results too. Thank you.